I decided to stalk her. If I could tell you had Hello everyone! Welcome back to the vlog. So today is literally my last first day of classes ever because today is my first day of my second year of my masters and I don't currently plan on studying more, at least for now. I don't know if I'm going to do a PhD in the future, but this is officially my last first day of classes. I'm really excited about it. I only have one class at 3 o'clock. It's currently 10 a.m. I got up uh, before 9, which is a miracle for me, but I'm really going to make an effort this year to get up early so I have more energy because last year with the lack of sunlight and all the darkness in the winter, like my energy levels went so, so down and in the summer, I discovered that I still have energy in me, so I need to keep up that level. So, if you saw my last vlog, you know that I just moved back to Iceland. My place is still a mess because I subletted my place for the summer and it's very nasty. It looked clean when I moved in, but <laughs> like, if you are vacuuming a place, you should vacuum beneath the couch and also beneath the bed. I don't think it's that hard and everything is like kind of sticky and icky and I really need to get this place like clean but we just unpacked all of our belongings we only have one trash bag full of random stuff that I really don't know what's in it that I need to put away I'm going to show you the current state of the place please don't judge me it's not good but after today, hopefully, it will be mostly done. So, the entryway is mostly cleared out. It still has some random little things that I need to put away. But the cabinets are all done. The bathroom is, like, mostly done. I need to clean up the floors. I have deep cleaned the bathroom, but, like, with running around, the floors need to be cleaned again. I already did all of the laundry, but, yeah. It's looking kind of good. Then when you come in, you can see that clearly the kitchen has a bunch of random things that need to be put away and cleaned. Like the things that are on the top of the counters, it's mostly because they need to be clean and I don't want to put them in the cabinets. So I need to take care of that today. This little desk area, it's clean, but I have a bunch of items that I need to put away, obviously. My little dining area, it's the only thing that is currently looking very good. And like you can see, we finally have four freaking chairs. We got one yesterday, if you saw my last vlog, you saw that. It was on outlet, so it was really, really cheap. Since last year, we have been trying to buy all four chairs, but they have always been really expensive, and we couldn't really afford them. So, yeah, after a year, we finally have this little corner, like, ready. The balcony area, I see need to put some things away, but I actually found this chair on, like, my storage area. So, it's just part of an Ikea set. I think I can find, like, another chair and a table that goes with it. I like, it's pretty cool that I found it. It's a bit rusty, but I think I can fix that. But besides that, I don't really have anything else on my balcony. The bedroom is, like, not tidied up at all. Like, I need to make the bed and put away a lot of the clothes that I didn't get to yesterday. But, yeah. I've been sitting here just working on my computer. I need to put a bit of those clothes away. But besides that, I just really need to clean up the floors and dust everything. For now, I'm just going to get back to doing some computer work because I need to like check my emails, get back to my advisor and my boss saying that I'm back in Iceland because I haven't done that actually and I need to get some new shifts in and organize how my thesis work is going to be for this year because as this is my second year of my master's, I mostly have thesis work to do. It's a 60 credit thesis, so I have a lot of work to do for that. But for this semester, I'm actually only taking two classes, one in the first seven weeks and the other one in the last seven weeks. So yeah, I'm going to do all my emails and also organize my notion because I haven't started even like a page for my full semester and then I need to do all of that. So I will show you. just 
leaving for class. This is like my second day of class's outfit. I kind of forgot to vlog yesterday, to be honest. I left in a hurry. Then I didn't get back until much later. I actually did a really cute walk because I wanted to see a Bali place. But I didn't bring my camera with me. I wish I could have shown that. And I made such a nice dinner, but I also forgot the vlog. So <laughs> today I'm actually going to make an effort to vlog. And also, I'm in love with my new short hair. Like, it's so freaking curly. I knew my hair was wavy, but like... This is something else, like I haven't had my hair this curly since I was a child. I really want to try like more of curly hair methods, like I'm using a conditioner that I think is really nice. But I want to actually like blow dry my hair with a diffuser and use some techniques with towels and all of that. So I have to do research on that. But yeah, I'm going to get going to class. Today is such a nice day also. Okay, just got out of class and change of plans. I think I'm actually going to go to a ballet class tonight. I just heard back from one of the ballet studios that I sent like a bunch of emails, basically to every studio in Reykjavik. And one of them said that I could try a class. <laughs> and they have classes today so I think I'm just going to try out I don't know if the school is way too professional for me like there are six classes per week and I'm working and studying at the same time and I don't know if I can do that but I'm just going to try it out and see how I like it I'm just heading home so I can eat something and maybe change for ballet. <laughs> so I'm just going to do my normal ballet one, but I feel bad by ruining like these curls because I like them so much. I haven't tried to do a bun with my short hair. <laughs> like, oh my God. I don't know if this is even going to stay on. I could try and maybe do a low bun instead, but I don't think I'm going to like that. Oh me, it looks so small and weird. Apparently we're not doing my normal bun because I cannot do that with my hair. I have this very weird, I can feel the hairs, uh, messy low bun that is supposed to be more on a sleek side, <laughs> but it's truly not. I had to search like hairstyles for Short hair, I should have done that before. Now I'm late, obviously. The class is in 45 minutes, so anything, I will just catch a scooter. But I have to hurry up because I don't wanna miss the class. I'm really excited about it. I don't know if I'm going to stick with the studio because this is more of a, like, a professional class and I have no intent of being a professional. And this is like six times a week and it's really, really expensive and i'm currently unemployed so i don't know if i will be able to afford this but i just have to try it out because Reykjavik doesn't really have many options there are six ballet studios one i have been last year i didn't really enjoy it the other one is closed there are two locations for this studio that i'm going to try today the other one is just like a dance studio which has like salsa it has ballet jazz, which isn't really a ballet, it's just once a week and it's just like for fun and to move and it's mostly target to adults. So it's definitely not going to ever get me on point and it's not going to teach me the technique that I want. Um, and then there is basically the most professional school here in Iceland which you do need to audition for and that's not something that I even want to do. So that leaves me with basically no options. So let's see how this one goes. I'm just going to go with this leotard that I'm already using. It's a bodysuit from Zara, but yeah. This is my ballet drawer. Um, I got some new shoes, but I don't think I'm going to wear them. I'm going to use the old crusty ones because I'm more comfortable. I'm just going to bring my skirt. Maybe this jacket. Mm, it's way too similar. Some tights, yes. I have new ones, but I'm going to use the ones that I feel comfortable with. Because I feel like this one's might be too orange. I'm not sure. So, I was just called for work for 1pm. Which 
it's literally 1 p.m. They called me like five minutes ago. I was going to make myself lunch. I was out buying onions, but I guess I'm going to bring my lunch to work. I'm just going to make something really quickly. I said that I would be there in half an hour, so yeah. <sighs> I wanted to go to the ballet studio that I went yesterday to talk about like tuition fees and how the classes work. I don't know if I'm gonna make it. It should be closing by the time that I get out of work, but we'll see. So for the base, I'm just going to be using this sauce that I made the other night. I'm just going to be removing like this garlic that was just used for the sauce itself. Then I'm going to be adding tomatoes, onions and peppers. Then I'm going to be adding some chickpeas. And lastly, half of an avocado. I'm just going to mix it up and now it's nice and saucy. And ready to eat. It actually looks really nice. This is a normal process. At the end of I went to the ballet studio and I already signed up for classes. I'm doing ballet six times a week. I'm doing like five normal ballet classes and then like on the weekends a point class, which I'm not doing point obviously, but I'm so excited. <laughs> like I'm destroyed after that other class and it's been two days. So six times a week, it's going to be something else but i'm beyond excited right now i'm just going to go to class today is such a beautiful day iceland has been so nice with all of these lovely days but yeah i'm going to my class it's currently noon i'm a bit early but i'm not going home for like 10 minutes and then be late to class so yeah after that i'm just going to go and have lunch and maybe check out a few places that might have like job openings or something. We will see in the ballet class at five. Yeah, my dudes, life is so nice here. I'm just full on in contemplation mode. I'm sitting in a bench at the park. The coffee shop that I wanna go and ask for like the job information is right over here. It's after five, so everyone is out and about like riding bikes and going for their evening run before they like go home and make dinner. So everyone is just in a good mood, which is so rare because like back in Portugal, no one is out in the streets at five o'clock, but now, like yeah like i told you in the morning today is such a beautiful day and i always forget that i live so close to the sea that i should just come by the sea every day but yeah i love it here i did this like updo for ballet for the first time because i don't know what to do with my short hair for ballet but we'll see how this goes i'm really excited to start like in a new place and i'm just feeling grateful about my life here in iceland If I could tell you, I don't think you just got out of ballet and again this is a, such a nice hour because like the light turned so pretty. But yeah, I'm absolutely starving and dead from the class. It was so difficult again and I'm so sore from last time that I couldn't really do much. But yeah, I'm still very excited. I think tomorrow there is another teacher like teaching the class 
so I'm excited to see how different it is. I think I'm just really going to eat some noodles tonight because I don't feel like cooking and it's kind of late already. Got home from ballet and also uh, grocery shopping. I'm cooking some gnocchi for dinner. I saw some recipe on TikTok that I'm going to try, and I feel like I'm really going to struggle to make this videos like entertaining and not super repetitive because I feel like my schedule is literally going to be the same every day since now I have ballet six, six times a week, so I can just be showing myself like getting ready for ballet leaving ballet class um so <laughs> yeah i just got back from grocery shopping because next week i'm going to the west fjords to do some field work for my thesis and i need to get some things to eat while i'm there and i'm just going to show you a few things that i got while i put them away got more coffee because we are always running out of it and it's just like a weekly basic got some feta cheese for salads because like you have been seeing i've been really into my salads got some granola bars not only because this is basically what i eat in field work because it gives me a lot of energy and it doesn't take up any space but also because i can never find them at bonus and i rarely like go to other grocery shops so i decided to stock up and besides granola bars, I eat baby fruit. <laughs> this is really random, but because it has like fruit and also sugars, it keeps me up with like eating two of these per day. Um, I'm going to be there for a week, so I got a few. And I also got ah, some fruit rolls. I've tried this, it's not that bad, but like it has the same goal, sugary, energy so i don't crash then we got some cod fish like breaded fillets and these little like fish balls that have cheese in the middle this is like a i've never seen this outside of iceland this is really good and it's like very good when you don't feel like cooking you just throw this in the oven and you have a meal got tomato sauce for dinner and also like a block of parmigiano reggiano because if you're buying cheese, you may as well like buy the good stuff. I don't know if this particular one is like good, but this is Iceland and you don't have much option. I got some blueberries, got some kleinur, uh, which is like an Icelandic cake. I don't know if this is really a cake, but it's like an Icelandic sweet. It's really nice. I, it really reminds me of like Portuguese um, Christmas desserts. They're really nice. Bananas and tomatoes, tortellini for some other meal, and these limoncello cakes. Um, again, very random, but I love limoncello and they got my attention. I don't like cakes, so I'm not sure if I'm going to like this, but at least I will try it. And that was what I got. I'm going to go back to my dinner and I'm going to show you because I'm really intrigued if this is going to turn out good.
it's Friday night and we have family that is coming to visit for the weekend and you already know that I feel really awkward vlogging with other people so I don't think I'm going to vlog even though I'm going to be like exploring the city and showing it around which might be interesting but I know myself and I know that I'm not going to vlog around other people and after that I'm just going to go to the West Fjords with people that I also don't know so vlogging is out of the question so I guess this is the end of this video I have a lot of video ideas that I want to post in the next few weeks and I'm really excited about them so if you want to see that please subscribe and if you like this video give it a thumbs up and I will see you in my next one. Bye!